So I'm doing this thing where I just turn on the camera without any plans. So I'm like anyone you know? Sounds like someone I know. Sounds like me. Um, I don't exactly know what I want to talk about. I guess I'll talk about some things that I've been doing lately. Um, I read The Fault in Our Stars about three months ago. Probably my favorite book of all time. And I haven't read very many books in my day, but it's my most favorite book of all time. And then I read An Abundance of Caverns. It's right up there, but it doesn't hold a candle to The Fault in Our Stars. So I'm making it a full. I want to read all of the John Green books this summer. There aren't that many, because he's still kind of young. So I, I think that it'll be a very succeedable, reachable goal. Um, I saw Rock of Ages in the theater yesterday, and it was great. <laughs> it was very vulgar and risque, and oh my god, I was sitting next to my dad. I felt so subconscious. Not self-conscious, I just felt awkward, but it was really good. I wanted to get up and dance and sing, and it was just a great movie. Um, I love Julianne Huff, and I was, I like to just look on IMDb and just randomly search through it, and I found out that she was an extra in Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. I mean, it, that is so cool. I wish that... I could have been an extra in Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. I was like 13 when it came out. I mean, like, I'm 14. When do I get to be extras in movies that are that are eventually going to be great? I mean, because I really, I really, this is so getting off subject. By the way, that I, I do want to become an actress, and I think I'd be really good at it. But I don't really care much about fame. I want to become like a Jennifer Lawrence actress pre-Hunger Games, just doing um, Academy Award winning Emmys. But it wasn't really Academy Award winning, just award winning Emmys. No, God, award winning Emmys. I want to do that sort of thing. And even if I can just be an extra on the side, I think it'd be very fulfilling because I'm so fascinated by film and television and I just love behind the scenes stuff and just you know to be there. Okay, I'm getting all mushy, but yeah. That's what's up. Um, I saw the movie one day and in the past two weeks I watched it twice on HBO. And it's really good. I really like it. Um, yeah, I think I should get that on D V D because it's really good and halfway has grown into a very good actress, and I like her a lot, and I love her accents. I probably need to rewatch and see if she came from Scotland in the movie, because she has a very Scottish accent, but I don't know if it's supposed to be British. Um, so, that's the thing. How has your summer been so far? Um, I've been three out of seven days of the week in my pajamas, not getting dressed. And I have professional practice on Monday, and then I work at the library from 3 to 6 on Tuesdays, so, you know, it uh, gives me a reason to uh, take a shower, or else I would not be. <laughs> um, this is getting embarrassing. I, I, I am an active Twitter user. I still use that, and they do pretty much daily. Um, I started using Instagram. I absolutely love it. If you want to follow me on those things, link in the down bar. Hope you're having a marvelous Sunday. Is it Sunday? Yes. Hope you're having a marvelous Sunday. Um, I'll see you later. Bye.